these destinations will have you feeling buena onda. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 Latin American countries to visit. For this list, we're focusing on countries only, not specific cities, that are culturally considered part of Latin America. Number 10. Dominican Republic If you're tired of going on the same old vacation, then pack up your suitcase and experience the cultural music of Latin America, Dominican style. Here's what you'll need. An open mind. And if you appreciate the value of human interaction, well, then you'll fit in just fine. As the most popular Caribbean destination, the Dominican Republic sees visitors often hitting up the usual points of interest on the island of Hispaniola, and one should definitely check them out. But here's a tip. Hit up a baseball game, walk the streets, and find a local restaurant to learn a thing about how the Dominicans really roll. Number 9. Bolivia If you're not quite keen on the party aspect of a holiday, then perhaps you'd enjoy a historical education from the indigenous people of Bolivia. Many will recognize the name La Higuera as the final destination of one Che Guevara. However, a more fitting cultural lesson in Bolivia would be to explore the salt flats or perhaps the stunning Lake Titicaca. Rich in heritage, including the must-see location of La Paz, visitors can expect plenty of physical activity given the Bolivian landscape, and if planned right, you'll surely find the ideal location to chill and let your mind process the thrill of it all. Number 8. Colombia Here's an absolutely stunning Latin American country that tends to get a bad rap. But just wait until you've seen the walled city of Cartagena and experience how Colombians share the collective wealth when it comes to their dynamic landscapes and cityscapes. In Medellin, one can take a ride on a popular metro cable or stay put on the ground at Laguna de Guatape and Parque Explora. Whatever your preference, plan enough time in order to roam from city to city, especially considering the scenic elements of such places as Bogotá and Salento, but also the day-to-day -day urban excitement of this magnificently developing country. Number 7. Chile With about 18 million inhabitants, this country stretches over 2,600 miles on the west side of South America while bordering the Pacific Ocean, so remember to bring your shorts. With that being said, however, the inland provides a vast array of adventure opportunities from Torre del Paine National Park or Altiplano Lagoons of San Pedro de Atacama. If you really want to do something truly unique, then you'll set sail off to the mythical Easter Island. For practical purposes though, Santiago is the way to go, as the Central Valley will give you a fix of modern Chile. Number 6. Costa Rica If you don't consider yourself to be a zipliner, this country's gorgeous scenery will surely make you reconsider. As one of the most rapidly developing countries of Latin America, Costa Rica affords a variety of outdoor fun, whether it's the La Fortuna Waterfall or Cahuita National Park. But you'll also want to explore the sites of its capital, San Jose, a city that will properly blow your mind with its architectural innovations and, well, the general way of life. There's much territory to cover overall, of course, and you just may find the perfect finale to your trip at Pura Aventura in El Guapote. Number 5. Cuba Upon touchdown, Cuba will challenge your preconceived notions of life itself, as this country's vibrant culture and charismatic personalities present an alternative to unnecessary stress. Of course, many tourists will arrive with their own expectations of places like Havana, thanks to the movies and such. But there's really no substitute for just winging it and exploring Cuba with a fresh set of eyes. Stop by Varadero Beach for sure, and definitely put down some rum in Old Havana. But remember to engage with the locals and find out what makes Cuba tick as well. Number 4. Peru Historically speaking, there's a giant elephant in the room when it comes to Peruvian travel plans, and that is none other than Machu Picchu, a 15th century Inca site located a few steps off the beaten path. You'll gain some serious travel cred for making the trip, but if you're feeling conservative, both Cusco and the capital city of Lima will suit you just fine. In the former, the Centro Histórico functions as the country's tourist focal point, and in the latter, one may decide to experience all that is Miraflores for a broader view of the city. Number 3. Argentina A neighbor to Chile, this sunny region is the largest Spanish-speaking country in the world. And with that being said, you'll have plenty of options for city dwelling along with must-see natural wonders like the Iguazu Falls, Garganta del Diablo, and the Perito Moreno Glacier. There's no end to the possibilities, so once you land in Buenos Aires and set up shop somewhere in Puerto Madero, you'll soon realize that a couple two or three days of shuffling around just won't be enough, as Córdoba and Rosario offer an equal amount of mind-broadening opportunities. Number 2. Brazil The word epic gets thrown around quite a bit, but with this massive landscape, that's exactly what you're getting. Of course, there's Rio, the host of the celebrated Carnival Festival, which itself alone will provide for a lifetime of memories. But here's what you'll want to do in Brazil. 
Turn off your phone and follow the yellow brick road across this majestic land. In fact, you might even want to make your own motorcycle diaries, actually circle the entire damn continent and not skip out on Brazil like the movie did. Put yourself in a Brazilian state of mind and set forth. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Number 1. Mexico Hmm, what to do in Mexico? Some will party, some will appreciate a fine resort, but for the average traveler less interested in constant partying or poolside naps, let us suggest the urban landscapes of Jalisco and Mexico City. Now that's some real Mexico there. Not to say each region doesn't have plenty to offer. We're just saying, if you want to go all in on your Mexican adventure, then kick it off right in Distrito Federal and work your way towards the beaches from coast to coast. It might sound like a lot, but you'll certainly be up for numerous trips after your first. Do you agree with our list? What Latin American country do you want to visit? For more mind-blowing top 10s published daily, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com.